maybe not press star and then show and then cut to the hit which it should I don't know why you're not getting a preview image up here it's really annoying isn't it doesn't load maybe click reload player stuff we got there I'm gonna put the mic live now. Right, I'm gonna put the mic live. Yeah. First match with Brentford B since. Uh, their 1 0 defeat at a very strong Chelsea 11 back in August, their first match in September, a glorious day in Melksham. And they'll take on the Skybet Lee 2 side. Bit of a mix, some first team involvement from Forest Green. And we'll be very underway very shortly here. Run you through the team in goal for Brentford B is Ben Winterbottom, Reynold Hercules at right back, Ben Hockenhole, Nico Jones, Lewis Gordon. Dom Jeffries in midfield alongside Ryan Trevitt and Max Haygarth. Nathan Young Coombs up top. Either side of them is Lachlan Brook and Jan Zamburek. It'll be Forest Green to get us underway. Ball immediately forward and Ben Hockenhall will, will rise high. Early foul, Forrest Green, a free kick out on the wide right side. I think it was Nico Jones going in there. And the Forest Green player looks like he's picked a bit of a knock there. Staying down for some time. Opportunity for Forest Green to put the ball into the box. Opportunity for 
ball in and Nico Jones does win it, flicks it away and Lewis Gordon just hooks the ball away. Forest Green who are last in action down at Exeter City at the weekend. A 0-0 draw, they're currently second in Skybet League 2. A very strong start to their campaign. I give their play That's a right now, Hercules. You know, Herc is under a bit of pressure here. They are dispossessed high up the field by Forest Green. It's Jay Young who looks to put the cross in there. And Ben Winter was quickly off his line. He's challenged in with uh, it's an opening. Actually, an offside. It was the ball was put in the net by Vaughan Coville, causing havoc down there on the left hand side. Brentford were picked in possession. Ben Winter was quickly out of his goal to Josh Marsh. He met him. The ball ended up in the net, thankfully, for the, the offside flag. Hercules goes inside to Jeffries. Jeffries on a more pressure for Brentford B. Dom Jeffries is picked in possession. And it was Ibu Adams who picked him in possession. Forest Green couldn't quite make the most of that opportunity. Brentford B under a bit of pressure in these opening few minutes. As Max Hagarth picks up the ball. And it's another given away ball there by, by Brentford B. Dom Jeffries manages to win it back though as he finds Zamburek. More pressure on Dom Jeffries as he finds it out to Lewis Gordon. Lewis Gordon looks initially for Nathan Young Coons, but the Brentford B striker's caught offside there. Turnover in possession. The ball now we're back with Ben Hockenhall. Looks for Ryan Trevitt. Once again, Brentford will be loose in possession. As Nathan Young Coombs looks to chase. Forest Green are an excellent action when they play Northampton at the weekend. Ball into Trevor. That's a quick ball forward, but Ben Winterbottom will collect that. Now Lewis Gordon goes wide to Jan Zamburek. And Gordon's dispossessed there. Ferris Green will charge forward. I think he was Vaughan Cove who was driving forward. It was a challenge from Dom Jeffries, but I think they managed to referee waved away and he claims for a foul. As the ball's now with Nathan Young Coons looks to hold it up. Now the Forest Green trialist looks down the line. And Hockenhol's beaten to it by the Forest Green. I think he was young. Ball crossed in. Lewis Gordon's up against Vaughan Koval. Jan, Jan Zambu for support out on that right hand side. The Forest Green man's trying to look after possession, but he's lost it. They'd probably look for a counter attack, but Trevitt's pass just ahead of uh, Max Hagar after he looks to charge forward. And the Forest Green trialis once again looks down the line. Ben Winterborn, Ben Winterborn quickly off his line. Bit of a push there from Josh March, trying to get him out of his area, but credit to the keeper, he managed to stay inside and hold on to the ball. We 
Through to bottom, looks long for Jan Zamburek. to press high as always really good pressure from Nathan Young Coombs right down on Lewis Thomas block the ball Brentford B of course without the likes of uh, Daniel Oyugoke Matt Cox Finn Stevens, Nathan Shepard and Joe Adams for they're off on international duty Nico Jones heads forward Finds Nathan Young Coombs. Good footwork and now Max Hagarth. Gordon looks to give and go as Anzan Burek, but got themselves a uh, throw in. Brentford B. As far as Green looks to charge forward down the left hand side, Ronald Hercules will meet Allen. Slides in quickly. Hercules Burn is a right back today. He's been deployed as a, a right wing back on many occasions by Brentford B. And set up as a part of a back four this afternoon. As the ball switched out for Forrest Green. And it's another foul. Forrest Green have a chance to put the ball in the box. Look like Jack Adams was fouled there. Of course, this is Brentford B's second visit to. Uh, the, the uh, Melksham Town FC played here last season in March. It was a 3-1 win for Brentford B that day. Top scorer last season. Aaron Presley got them going and Gustav Mogensen and Lachlan Brook also found the net that day. Very different conditions to what we find in a sunny Melksham today. As the ball is hooked up into the air and Max Hagarth will now challenge along with Jan Zamburek. Body's battling in the middle. Hagarth's dispossessed there. He's asked for a foul. The referee's waved away those claims. As Forrest Green come down that right-hand side. He's plenty of Brentford bodies back. They can't stop the cross there. And it's all the way over to Rayner Hercules at the far post. It's a challenge from Hercules. And I think there were a few initial shouts for a penalty from Forrest Green. But they'll have to settle for a corner. Another chance to put the ball in the box, put this young B team under a bit of aerial pressure. Ball into the box. It's headed by a Forest Green player. Nico Jones was involved, but it's come out of the box and Max Hagar's picked up the loose ball out wide. He's charging forwards. He has bought himself a foul. Max Hager, I've looked to get play the free kick quickly, but the referee pulled it back. I think the ball is still moving. He's just looking for options. He's going to leave it for Nico Jones. Bit of spaceless right hand side for Raynor Hercules. He's jogging forward. He'll have to go back to Hockenhol. He now looks for Jan Zamburek, but it's over hit. And of course, these two clubs did meet very recently in the Carabao Cup. 3 1 win for Brentford. And the lead two side so have a really, really good account of themselves on the night. Forest Green looks to come down this left hand side. Looking very accomplished in possession in these early stages. We look forward, the ball's there for Taylor Allen. It's picked up by Josh March on the left, he'll run at Hercules. Drives down the left, ball low cross in, hook and hold just brings it under control. Doesn't take any chances. Yeah. 
Pressure from Trevor. Not letting Diallo have a moment's thought, but he does manage to get the ball out to the right hand side as Lewis Gordon also presses. That's a loose ball, it's picked up by Lachlan Brook outside the box. It's a really good challenge by the uh, Forest Green trialist. Lachlan Brook would have looked to get forward and perhaps even have a shot on goal, but it's good defending. Pass to Lewis Gordon. Gordon sets Zamburek on. All the way down the left. It's a really good recovery challenge there from the Forest Green defender, Luke Hallett. Headed by Allen, but Hercules will pick up the loose ball. Short from Hercules, but Trevor does manage to win the ball back. Now Hagarth. Neil McFarlane just decides to be tidier on the ball. He's done well here down the left as Zamburic plays down Gordon on the overlap. Might just be urging his side just to take a bit more care, a bit more time on the ball. Good pressure from Brooke. Brook. He's found Young Coombs in a bit of space here. Young, Young Coombs. And Hagar pick up the loose ball. Lachlan Brook does shoot. It's really good play. Lachlan Brook found the ball inside to Young Coombs. Young Coombs drove forward. He's appealed to the referee saying there was a foul. He was after a penalty, but Brook shot. Green, it will come out to the edge of the box of Lewis Gordon. Hock and Hull feeds it back in. Lachlan Brook just offside there. The post. Uh, Forest Green charged down this left hand side. Under pressure from Max Hagarth. Referee gives Brentford B the throw.
Ball forward, Young Coombs looks to pick up that loose pass. Pressure on the goalkeeper once again. Jeffries picks it up, he's dispossessed. Ebru Adams with the challenge and Forrest Green will come forward once again. They'll work it out wide. Ball in. Uh, it's an effort there. Josh March with the effort. It gives Ben Hockenhol just in the way, managed to block it. Another Forest Green corner over on the far side. Austin, Ben Winterbottom is challenging, he gets a good fist to it, punches it away. Forrest Green will collect the loose ball and look to sustain this attack. It's played out well to the right hand side. The player's touch is loose and Zambura manages to win the ball and drive away. He's found Lachlan and Brook on the right hand side but Wiseman says Brook straight offside. It's a really good move there from Bradford B, good play for Zambura. Another long ball forward from Forest Green down the left hand side. Josh March once again chases in the channel. Bit of space there for Adams to turn and shoot. It's a really, really good save from Ben Winterbottom. Plenty of space there for Adams. He turned and had a good look before shooting. It's a low effort, really good stop from Ben Winterbottom. quickly off his line to deny Jake Young who was on rushing Gordon now into Zamburk gives and go with Dom Jeffries looks to find Young Coombs in behind Young Coombs has got a really good chance here. he's in behind the Forest Green back line oh, and he's hit the post really really good attempt from Nathan Young Coombs drove in behind but his effort with the left foot low looked like he's going for that but just came against the post Beverly's best opportunity of the game so far These challenges down the forest green left hand side. As Dom Jeffries manages to clear the ball away, but it is collected by Forest Green. Very comfortable in possession, the lead two side. No Diallo. Nico Jones just collected that loose ball. He looks down the right hand side. That was a really good opportunity for. Nathan Young Coombs a few moments ago. The effort came against the post. He's been speaking recently about he's not too concerned that he hasn't found the net recently. He puts in such a shift for the team. But he'll be def desperately looking to get another goal under his belt for Brentford B this season. Of course, scored on his debut against Cambridge. Zamburek hooks it away but it's straight into the path of the Forest Green players and Brooke manages to pinch possession he's done really well there the Forest Green tries to prevent any sort of counter attack for Brentford B Hagar challenging in there but he is brought down eventually back to 
Hockenheim. Now Trevor Jeffries into Brook. Really good play from Brentford B. As Brook switches the ball, he looks at Zamburek, but once again the offside flags up. Young Coombs chases and it's gone long over the head of Lewis Gordon. He will collect the ball for a throw. Neither side really dominating here, but probably argue Brentford had the better of the chances and Nathan Young Coombs hitting the post. It was a shot from distance from Adams for Forest Green, which Brent went to bottom saved. As Jeffries sends the ball out to Lachlan Brook. So lucky for Dom Jeffries, Will McFarlane applauds the effort. Really good looking ball out to the wide, to the right hand side, but just over hit. Oh, oh, now with Gordon, he looks to come forward and go out wide to Jan Zamburek. Gives and goes with Gordon. Comes back out to Max Hagarth. That's good feet from Hagarth to keep the ball. Really good play, Trevor. Now back with Hagarth. Adams flying in there. He manages to win the ball back for Forest Green. Plenty of battling in there. The referee decides to let the play go. As Adams looks down the right. But Gordon's in the way. Distance, he's just miscued it there. Really good opportunity for Lockham and Brook. Bit of space, drives forward but just shoots low. Same ground where Lockham and Brook grabbed his first goal for Brentford B last season. Got the third of the 3 1 win. Good pressure from Young Coombs. Forest Green do well to retain possession though. possession manages to squirrel the ball out to Ryan Trevitt good play Ryan Trevitt into the field Locker Brook Brook tried to flick but at least he's won himself a, a throw in Trevor a bit frustrated there. He went to play the ball back to Hercules. Referee says. That he ended up putting the ball out despite the challenge. Once again, Jeffries hooks it away. It's good work away from Lockland Brook. He's won the ball back alongside Max Hagarth. 
credit to Adams, there's a good block there. Hagar still challenging in the middle. For Zamburu, but Brentford B will have a corner chance with the ball into the box. Lights of Jones in there. And hook and hole. Aerial presence from Redford B. Keepers out quickly. He tries to claim, but the ball finds its way out of the box. The keeper couldn't quite hold on to it. Hercules tries to prevent the forest green counter. Dom Jeffries also helping out. Lewis Thomas brings the ball forward. Max Hagar challenging in the middle. It's fouled by Adams. Hercules now to Brooke. Brooke will look to come inside. He's got lots of bodies around him. He is dispossessed. Chance for Jay Young to drive forward. He's driving at Nico Jones here. And he managed to work some space. He's gone past Hercules too. BT bodies flooding back. And the ball eventually did come in from Taylor Allen, but once again, Winterbottom was there to claim it. It's Gordon. To create something on the left hand side. Always a threat going forwards. And worked out to the right to Trevor. Now Brooke. Hercules is on the overlap. Chance for Hercules goes inside with Zamburuk. Zamburuk will bring the ball into the Forest Green box. It's not got a lot of options. And Matralis wins the ball back from him. It's an interesting one there with the Forest Green player going down and appealing for the foul. The linesman right in front of him didn't actually give anything, but the referee did. for a quick drinks break here. Very warm here in Melksham. Let's have a pause in play. Neither side really dominating this game. Best chance once again for, for Nathan young as he hit the post. Probably come closest to the teams to scoring.
Yeah, so a short drinks break, we'll be back underway again shortly. As I say, very, very warm here. Almost cast back to the days of Brentford B being on tour away in Europe. Very warm. We had about 15 or so to play. Thomas takes the free kick from that bottom end of the pitch. As Jones heads for Trevitt, challenging, has done well to control the ball there. Hercules looks first time out for Jan Zamburek. Space for Brentford B to get in down this left hand side. Zamburek's got Gordon in support. That's good play there, Max Hagarth. Ball into Jan Zamburek. Can he find an effort? That's uh, a good effort from Jan Zamburek. Good play going down the left hand side. Hagarth looked inside for him and he's looked for that top corner, the far corner, but just over. Zamburek, of course, getting more minutes for Brentford B. Had a, an injury. He's out for a fair few months, but building the minutes back with Brentford B. Yeah, but Val urging his side to stay forward. He wants his side to, to keep the pressure on Forest Green. It was a good moment there for Zamburek. Oh, another free kick for Forest Green. I think it was Hagar's challenge on Josh March. All switched out wide. It's Hercules chases. It's blocked by the shoulder of Raynal Hercules. Jeffrey's going in there alongside Adams. Balls out to Young. Young turns well. That's really, really good play from Hagarth. Wins the ball back. That's haven't cleared yet though. They let's go down the right hand side. Driving at Lewis Gordon. The ball does come in. Ben Winterbottom pushes the ball away and it is to Adams. Adams looks for a first time effort but it is wide a goal. Ben Winterbottom under a bit of pressure in the air there. He managed to get a hand to it but it did fall for Adams and he, he put the effort wide. Short to Hockenhall and now Trevitt. Hockenhall will turn out, look to get on the right hand side but it's miscued, it'll be a forest green thrown. <laughs> and a two deadline day outgoings for Brentford B. At the end of the summer transfer window, Alex Gilb, of course, went on loan to, to Swindon Town and Jako Oxanen up to Scotland with, with Great at Morton in the Scottish Champions.
Full forward by Forest Green, Nico Jones challenges, wins it really well. It was Gordon, can't quite clear though. Charles of Forest Green on that right hand side. Ball comes in, Adams is unmarked. Oh, that's a really good opportunity, Jay Young. Adams went for the acrobatic but it fell for Young. Young controlled it well and shot just wide. I think he did take a deflection so we'll have a, a corner for Forest Green. We've got about five or so minutes to go in this half. In from Adams. There's Josh March rising high there. Couldn't quite glance his header towards goal though. Brooke. Young. Once again, involved. Hercules gives the ball away, but credit to Trevor, he won it back. Forest Green try. Jack Adams with the ball on the edge of the box. Winterbottom looks for Lachlan Brook on the right. Brook will. Unfortunately, he challenged up high. He thought the ball almost fell for him down that right hand side. Hercules challenging. Forrest Green looks to take a quick free kick. He was young there, driving forwards, but he's pulled back for offside.
Definitely just goes back to Winterbottom. Now to Hockenhall. Straight into midfield with Trevor. Trevor just looks after the ball. Ball four with Young Coombs. Young Coombs has a drive down the left. Lewis Gordon's with him. Really good pressure from Young Coombs. He's been pulled back for a foul there on the player. Kind of slightly frustrated figure there, Nathan Young Coombs. He's not had a lot of fortune going forward recently in this particular match. too long to go left in this first half we've had 45 officially but there was a, a short break for our drinks midway through the first period Winterbottom looks forward really well controlled by Lock and Brook retain the ball and he looks out wide to Lewis Gordon from Ben Winterbottom. <laughs> Jeffries challenges. Loose ball now. Ball knocked forward. And the referee just pulled it back for uh, injury for our screen player.
but because I've And welcome back to Melksham as uh, Brentford B take on Forest Green 11. No changes at the break for Brentford. Early offside for uh, Forest Green. It's a challenge for Reino Hercules at the far post, but the referee put his flag up. Lines and swipe put his flag up very quickly. Hercules slides in, manages to win himself a throw in on the far side. Hercules looks forward to Young Coombs. Lockenbutt looks to bring it back down, but he is dispossessed. Zamberg would look to come forward. It's a strong challenge there from Vaughan Coville, but the referee says play on. Adams looks inside, Ben Hockenau heads away, but there's a man over on the far side for Forest Green. It's a strike, but it's well over. Chance there, the Forest Green player had a lot of space. He miscued his effort. Bottom looks forward for Young Coombs. Challenges with Harvey Bunker. Oh, 
Lewis Gordon wins the ball back. Very stop start. Begin into the second half. forward from Thomas once again Winterbottom collects goes all the way through to him neither side really able to dominate possession so far being traded frequently as far as Green come forward Young look to play in the uh, Forest Green fullback is really well read by Lewis Gordon. Now Adams. Jay Young will look to drive into the box. Trevor brings the ball forward. Once again, the pass is misplaced for Renford B. Lewis Gordon doesn't take any chances. Ben Winterbottom was quickly off his line, but Lewis decided to take no chances and clear the ball away. Very hot conditions for the players out there today. Jeffries heads forward. Hercules opportunity to drive down the right. Heating up a lot of ground here. He does check it back into Trevitt. Now Brook. Max Hagarth. Loads of bodies in the midfield, but. Brentford be unable to come out with it. As Hockenhall heads forward. Hockenhall finds Hagarth. Hagarth with space to drive into. It looks wide to Lewis Gordon. Can Brentford B start to really kind of dominate this game? As Gordon looks to Zambia. Burak comes out to Trevor. Hercules in loads of space on the right. Trevor opts not to use him. He drives forward, but he's dispossessed. As Young looks to get away from Jones. Jones did look back towards the linesman and saw him. Flag was up, another offside for Forest Green. Jones under pressure. Forced to go back to Ben Winterbottom. Nico Jones, who signed after departing Oxford United in the summer. Good turn from Hagarth. Lots of forest green bodies around him. Pocket hole looks long for young Coombs. Challenging with the Forest Green trialist. 
Diallo turns, drives forward, tries to play a 1 2 with Adam. But Gordon wins the header, and Zambura can't quite bring it under his spell. And Forrest Goon will look to go forward down the right into the box. Plenty of Brentford bodies back, closing the space as Jeffries clears away first time. Space here for Forrest Goon on the left hand side. Hercules does well to try and get back and there's a crowd of bodies in the area. Forest Green will have a corner. Ball in for Forest Green. Hock and hole, really good header from the defender. And Jeffries clears away the second attempt. Interesting to see when Neil McFarlane does use his substitutions. He's got a few trialists on the bench. Well, Adadokan as well. As well as Jude Russell in defence. Jones clears away towards Brooke. Brooke can't win the header. March flicks the ball out wide. Jay Young there charging on the left. He's done well to ensure it was only a Brentford throwing. Hercules with a Flicked on by Trevitt. And Coombs couldn't quite get on the end of that flick. Forest Green will look to come out to the right hand side. There's Gordon challenges. Forest Green perhaps dominating things now in terms of possession. Not creating too much to threaten Ben Winterbottom's goal, but certainly seeing a lot more of the ball in promising positions. Comes here once again, Hock and Hole's there. Brooke looked to charge forward but couldn't quite get under control. Once again, Forrest Green have the ball.
Stay in the midfield. Really well taken by Lachlan Brook. Good take from Brook. He looked to play Zambuik in down the left, but he miscued the pass. First green player there. Okay, on the right with Coville, plays a 1 2. Diallo. Young with the pass, but falls all the way out to Hercules. Winterbottom gives the ball away, but it's really, really well played there from Hagar to win the ball back. Jeffries can bring the ball forwards. to Jay Young from Coval on the right looks to turn but it's really really well defended by Ben Hockenau finds Zambura Zambura comes down the left hand side checks inside to Hagar Hagar finds Zambura Luke Howick quickly into Jan Zambura there clears the ball away Brentford Beagle makes some changes here one of the trialists coming on for Nico Jones Good out or serve play for Nico Jones. <laughs> Try to still slot into the centre of defence alongside Ben Hockenhall. It's over the trialist head. Ben Hockenhall challenging there. I think it's March who's in on goal. He's lifted the ball over Ben Winterbottom and actually over the crossbar. He slide this way with how they defended that. Brentford B. The ball wasn't cleared. It was Josh March who latched onto it. Looked to lift the ball over Winterbottom, but thankfully just over the bar too. In play with the looks like it's Ibu Adams down receiving a bit of treatment. The players will come over to get a drink. As I said before, it's very, very hot out there.
Das ist gut. I'm on mute in the mic. Got a change. And incidentally, in this stoppage, we'll make a, another change. It's uh, Rainer Hercules coming off for Jude Russell. Jude Russell, of course, another summer arrival for Brentford B. Spent a short time on trial with Brentford last season. And then departed Crystal Palace in the summer and he's moved over to West London to join Neil McFarlane's side. Nathan Young Coombs going the closest with a, an effort that hit the post. Forrest Green perhaps seeing a bit more of the ball in the second half, but not really able to create too much. There was a chance for Josh March, who managed to get in behind the Brentford defence and tried to loop the ball over Ben Winterbottom, but just miscued as the ball went over the goal, too, as we get back underway. Around about 30 or so minutes to play. Strike there from Young. Hit it first time, trying to catch Winterbottom out. Winterbottom was a light to it. Full forward to March. Now Adams. Good pressure from Trevitt. Called up for a foul there, though. Forest Green looked to get it going quick, but the pass is over hit. Ryan Trevitt out to the right to Lachlan Brook Brook with a cross in here's towards Young Coombs but cleared away by Harvey Bunker out on the right. He's got too many options, he looks to beat his man, he checks back. He's done really well, Lachlan Brook, but it's just over hit. Runs the ball out of play. Went to beat the trialist, he knocked the ball round him, but a little bit too much on it. Everybody just looking for that little bit of a spark to create something. from Thomas. It's the head of Russell. And it's flipped behind. Forrest Green want to get this throw and take him quickly. Try and catch Brentford out. Forrest Green trialist looks to protect the ball. Lachlan Brooks doing really well to challenge. He's won himself a free kick. Credit to the, the young Australian. Throw 
Now with Young, Jeffries challenging. Breaks the brook. Fires Jeffries who looks to get it forward quickly, but Forrest Green there once again. It's Gordon challenges. Now Zamburk. Really good feed from Zamburk. Did really well to beat his man. And Hagar for looks to play it down the left hand side for Zamburk to chase. Cleared away by Forrest Green. And about 20 minutes to go in the second half here in Melksham. And Lewis Gordon fouled there. Looked like he beat Coville, but Paul Coville dragged him back by the shirt as Dom Jeffries gets the ball underway. It's pulled back by the referee. Looks for Jeffries. Jeffries spreads it out wide to Jude Russell. Malcolm Brook has seen a fair bit of the ball in this second half. Not really in the areas that you'd want him though. Mr. Charles looks for Zamburu, but Rev be dispossessed. Hock and Hobbs there though. Trevor challenges Gordon as well. Jude Russell brings the ball down, he drives out towards the right hand side. Oh no, the trialist finds Lewis Gordon into Max Hagar. Max Hagar just Push from behind there. Wins a foul. Plays it quickly. Zambur. It looks for Young Coombs. And Zambur. Goes short to Lachlan Brook. Clever ball from Brook inside for Hagar, but just over here as Forrest Green managed to clear. Good pressure from Brentford. They're trying to win the ball back. Trevor involved. Appeals for a foul, but the referee says no. Wins the ball and collects into the path of Hockenhall. Hockenhall will look long. Headed away by Luke Hallett into the hands of Lewis Thomas. For the trialist wins the header. Space for Young. Plays the ball into the box. It's just over the head of Ebu Adams as Ben Winterbottom collects. Jeffrey sprays the ball out to Lachlan Brook. Brook takes it well on his chest. Brook into the path of Trevor. Trevor will come into the box. Ball across from Ryan Trevor. Nathan Young Coombs is attacking that front post, but credit to Lewis Thomas, who was positioned well and just pounced on that ball as it came across. from Gordon, he finds Zamburk. Yeah. 
Samburic challenging once again. He wins it back with the help of Max Hagar. Samburic drives forwards. And he hits with his right foot, but it's a well blocked effort. Brook looks to be his man Out on the right hand side. Can he find a bit of space to get an effort towards goal? He's got Jeffries on the overlap, but cleared away well. And the Forest Green defence will have another Brentford corner. And Paul's in play with the Forest Green player down receiving a bit of treatment. to play here in Melksham was still goalless. Looks like Brentford will make a couple of changes in the next few minutes. Val Adodoka again ready to come on. Of course, been away with Ireland under 19s for a training camp recently. His first call up to the under 19s. Signed very recently from Dundalk. Ball comes in from Brook. The trialist won the header, but Forrest Green managed to take the ball away. Hockenhall goes into a challenge, but. Forest Green managed to counter. They look to switch the ball. Good position for Jude Russell and Ben Winterbottom. Winterbottom, I think, just misjudged that slightly and he was almost out of his area, so he just opted to knee the ball away from danger. Austin Cover will collect this. He's got Lewis Gordon for company. Wants to come back. Going back with Young. Young with a chance to put a really dangerous cross in. There was no one on the end of it. it wasn't a nice one for Ben Winterbottom to, to deal with, but luckily it sailed past every player in the box. Brentford Lee will make their changes now. A trialist midfielder coming on. And it's Shaw there, and Cove will pick the ball up. Max Hagarth going in challenge. Both players are down injured. And we'll have treatment for both players. Half down, just receiving a bit of treatment. Felt like an injury to his right leg. <laughs> Message seems to be that he's okay to continue. Jeffries leaves the field. And one of the Brentford trialists coming on. Ah, the Doe can also want.
This is Jan Zamburg and Dom Jeffries off. Val Adedokun and the Brentford trial is coming on. Chance to have a first proper look at Val Adedokun. He did feature against the Chelsea 11 a couple of weeks ago. The second half substitute in that behind closed doors fixture. Neil McFarlane does say Fantastic work back there. Ryan Trevitt, Jay Young looked like he was coming on a goal, looked like he was going to pull the trigger and shoot. But for Ryan Trevitt, really, really, really good defending from the midfielder. Adedokun looks for Nathan Young Coombs. Really, really well held by Nathan Young Coombs, and Ryan Trevor's there to help him out. Spreads the play wide to Lachlan Brook. To the path of Max Hagar. Chance to shoot for Max Hagar. It's well blocked. Chance for a corner kick for Brentford B. Ryan Trevitt with the delivery. In towards the Brentford trial as he flicked a header, tried to glance it towards goal, but Miscued. Into the path of Young. Young with a bit of space. Once again, Trevor's with him, but manages to shrug him off, and Young drives forward past the Brentford defence. And he's also been on goal, and it's a really, really good opportunity. Young driving forward, tried to find the far corner, but it's just nestled wide of the post Brentford B really let off there Young travelled very very far without challenge Lachlan <laughs> tried to get down the right hand side he's fouled there by Taylor Allen kicks the ball away frustrated Hagar gets the ball going. Maybe five or six minutes remain of the 90. Can Brentford V find a winner? Not been a lot between these two sides all afternoon. Adadokan into Hagar. Really good feet from Max Hagar. The trial has spreads the play. It's now with Lachlan Brook on the right hand side. Inside to Hagar. Worked out to the left to Lewis Gordon. Now Adadokan. Good ball forward for Gordon. He's latched onto it. It's a low cross. Once again, Young Coombs was lurking in there, but the cross was just claimed by Lewis Thomas.
Jimmy Russell into Ryan Trevitt. Dispossessed there. And there's a chance here for March. And very, very good save for Ben Winterbottom. He's out very quickly. Never be with dispossessed. Ball fell for March. Looked to clip it over Ben Winterbottom, who's out very quickly off his line. He made the save. Corner for Forest Green. Really dangerous area. It's a free header in the middle of the pitch. Middle of the, I think it was Jack Adams. Around about the six yard area. A free header. Couldn't keep it on target. I'll have a bit of a let off there for Brentford B. Forest Green make a change. Only a few minutes left here. Wins a ball with a kick forward. Looks for Adadokan who will challenge in the air. Gordon picks up the loose ball. Always greed is slightly out of shape, but really good feed from Adadokan. Battling away, it's fallen out for Max Hagar to collect. Goes back to the Brentford trialist defender. Went to looks at Jude Russell, but coming together, it'll be a Forest Green throw. Forward again from Lewis Thomas in the Forest Green goal. It's over the head of Hockenhall. Chance for March. Now with Adams comes inside. Hockenhall is there, battling away, as is Lock and Brook. Give and go here, Forest Green and Man over on the left hand side. The ball comes in, headed away by the Brentford trialist. <laughs> Diallo, really good feed from him, managed to retain possession under pressure from the Brentford defenders. All good feed from Diallo, a dispossessed. Brentford look to get away with Ryan Trevitt. Sliding in there is Adams. Could be a final change for Forest Green as Adams makes way. Finn Bell. <laughs> Foul on Ben Hocken there for March. Hockenhall 
looks out to Gordon. Gordon flicks the header. Charles back to Ben Winterbottom and pumped the ball away, but it's straight to the Forest Green player. Can't quite bring it under control. Less than a minute remaining here in Melksham. Still nil nil. Coombs still working, still running. Even after 90 or so minutes in that heat. It's a ball forward and it's missed by the Brentford defence. There's a free ball in there and it's actually put wide. JJ Oyabumiji. He was offside, but the Brentford defenders didn't exactly know that. to bottom kicks long out to Adadokan challenge as well a foul Forest Green's way Brentford needs to give their concentration here as Forest Green look out to the wide but it's broken down Jude Russell finds Lockenbrook Lockenbrook looked for Ryan Trevor who was running into space it was a really good idea from Brook but execution wasn't quite there it's Hagar's dispossessed. Forest Green charge forward. Ball now with March. And it's wide of goal. Ball down the right to Josh March. Hit it with his right foot. Wrong side of the near post from his perspective. Thank you to all those at home who are watching this afternoon. We do apologise for those technical issues that have popped up now and again throughout the match. Support is always appreciated from home for the young Brentford B team. As Max Hagarth goes into challenge, as does a Brentford trialist, add a doken to Hagarth. Really good feat from Hagarth. Well into added time now here in Melksham. Trevor cushions it into the path of the trialist. Trevor once again wins the ball back. Forest Green look down the channel with March. It's a really good defender for the Brentford trialist. Flick forward, Brentford Trialis is involved there. He manages to knock the ball away from the Forest Green attacker. And we'll have a Forest Green corner. As I say, well into added time. Surely a goal now would certainly win it for either team. Ball comes in as a crowd of bodies. It's flicked by a Forest Green player, but it's out to Lachlan Brook, who tried to bring the ball away. Nathan Young Coombs goes to challenge. Balls with Adams, who puts a cross into the box. But it's collected by a Forest Green player, out wide on the right hand side. Forest Green player is down 
up to his feet now in the box. Pressure from Trevor, wins the ball back from Bell. Trevor, long ball looks forward for Lachlan Brook. And Ryan Trevor just fouled there as he managed to get the ball away. Charles switches the ball out towards Lachlan Brook. He's unable to bring it down though. And that's it. That's a full time Forest Green Rovers 11 0. Brentford B 0. Brentford B did have a really good opportunity. Nathan Young Coombs did it at the post. There's been a couple of chances for Forest Green, but neither side has been able.